that even mean, Bowers Game Corner? Ahoy there, YouTube. I'm back again today for another game preview charge by BoardGameExchange.com, the internet's only board game rental website. Today I'm very excited to be checking out Mata Mati from Mata Mati Enterprises. This is for three to eight players, ages 12 and up, and uh, the length it takes to play will vary depending on how many players you have. But in Mata Mati, this, you will be laying down these square cards with numbers on the back, trying to optimize how many points you are going to get. Let's open it up and see how it plays. So, Mata Mati, let's take a look at what you're going to get. First and foremost, you're going to get your handy dandy rule booklet. Uh, this is obviously the prototype edition of the game because this is a Kickstarter game. It's up right now. Uh, but it's very useful and it will leave no question unanswered. It's a very simple game once you know what you're doing. So we'll set that to the side. Next, you're going to get a whole bunch of square cards. And these are the heart of the game. These are what you're going to be playing with. And they will have various different things on them. Uh, each one is going to have four numbers on them. Now, they might be the same like this one, 2299. Or they might be completely different and have, you know, this one, which is like 2468. But these are what you're going to use to score points in the game. Uh, also, there's some that have wilds on them, these little... W's represent wild, so you can place them wherever you want and not be penalized any points. Uh, but in this game, you're going to be trying to get the most points as possible by laying down these cards uh, inside, well, on this ring that we're going to form right here in the board. Uh, so you're going to start off, you're going to get six cards, which will be in your hand. This is going to be your hand. Then you're going to have what's called a reserve deck. Now this is going to be six cards that you personally are going to be drawing from. You can't look at them, but you're going to be flipping them up once you play a card. So one person is going to be the dealer. And then everyone else, and we're going to do a three-player game, is going to start playing around the table on these cards and gaining points. How does that work? I'll show you. So... Uh, what you want to do is you want to try and match up the numbers. So this is very good. However, this, not so good. So, to start off, you can't really be penalized because, well, as long as you have something that matches a 1, a 2, an 8, a 3, a 7, a 9, or a 0, you're good. So, for what we're going to do, first thing is we're going to place the 8 right here. So how this works is, we're going to double our match. So in this case, we've got 16. So we're going to double that to 32. And we have 32 points right there. Very nice start. And then you're going to write down the fact you had 32. You're going to draw from your reserve deck. And the next player is going to go. So we'll say over here, because we go counterclockwise in this household. We're going to look at this, and we're going to take a look. And the thing is, he can't play here. He has to play in one of these empty ones to start off the game. So he looks here, he's like, all right, I got an eight, but if I do this eight, then this three isn't gonna work out. I don't wanna do that. So he'll take the nine, very nice. So put that nine right there. He'll draw up on the reserve deck. We'll add up the points. So he gets nine, 18, and then uh, that's gonna be doubled. So he'll have 36 points. Very nice indeed as well. So 32 points, 36 points, he's drawn up. Now this guy is going to go, and he's going to, you know, we'll play this too because he doesn't have a choice. And here's how, we're just going to show you how penalizing points works. So he's going to gain these two and two, so four, where he's going to gain his eight points. But then at the same time, mismatches are added and then deducted from the points. So he got four points, but at the same time, he's going to minus 17 from his four, which means he's got negative 13 to start off with. Not a great way to start the game. But anywho, uh, you're going to be matching these up, and eventually you're going to get the entire outside of the ring filled up with the cards from your hand and the cards from the reserve deck. You can only make it so it is going to be four by four. Now, once you've filled it up to four by four, the dealer, and this is where it gets interesting, is only going to be able to play over top of these cards, while everyone else... Uh, the, all the other players are going to be playing on the outside. But you're going to play until you get rid of all the cards in your hand. So you'll be doing that and then tabulating up different points and all sorts of different things. You're going to tabulate up your points and then you're going to repeat. You're, you're going to play until everyone has had an opportunity to be a dealer. At the end of that, you're going to see who has the most points. The one with the most points is the winner of Mata Mati. All right, Mata Mati from Mata Mati Enterprises. Who is going to be digging this game? First and foremost, if you are a teacher or you're looking for an educational tool, look no further. This will be an outstanding educational tool for, ch for children who are about to learn mathematics. I personally will be keeping this game and playing it with my son when he gets old enough to learn how to do mathematics because it's, it's outstanding in that aspect. Also, if you have what I like to call power grid syndrome, 
where you love maximizing out points. You're going to have six cards in your hand, and there's going to be a boatload of possibilities on how you're going to play these cards. And and you your brain is really going to be like, oh my gosh, I could go here, that's going to get me 36 points, that's going to get me 24, and that's going to get me 21. Oh, no, I played that, now I can get, no, I can play that double wild, do this, and the 16, and I get 37 here. If you're one of those people who loves numbers, you are going to really enjoy this game, because constantly the board is going to be changing, and exactly where to optimize your points is going to be changing. Uh, uh, if you're interested in this game, be sure to check out the link below. Tell them Bowers Game Corner sent you. If you enjoyed this review, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for your time, YouTube. That was the review for Mata Mati. For more reviews and previews, check back at Bowers Game Corner. Also, check out BoardGameExchange.com, the nationwide board game rental service.